Hey guys, Jeremy, KJ7IAZ here, and today we're gonna do a little quick overview of how to do WinLink email with Vera FM over um, the air on an IAC705. So come with me, and I'll show you how I have this thing set up. All right, so first of all, we've got the IC705, and uh, it's just hooked up to the USB cable. I've got toroids on it uh, to keep the RF out of the computer. And then we've got, uh, I have my Surface Pro 3, and I'm gonna show you guys how I do this. So first of all, we're gonna come down here to WinLink Express, get that opened up, and you will see uh, what looks like basically an email program. There's all kinds of stuff that are going to be similar to an email program. So we're going to write an email, we're going to go up to here to New Messages, and we're going to just type in Test. You can type in a call sign. So if you guys want to send me an email on WinLink, go ahead. It's just KJ7IAZ in the two line. And then I'm going to write test message in the subject. And then testing. I cannot type for YouTube. And I'm going to post it to the Outbox. Okay, now in this drop down box over here, you're going to pick Vera FM WinLink. Now, there's all kinds of other um, WinLinks that you can get and you can use, but this is what we're doing is Vera FM. So we'll go to Vera FM, open a session, and you will see a couple other windows pop up. So the first one here is uh, Vera FM. So that's going to be actually our modem software. It's going to show you what's kind of going on with that. And over here is going to be your interface to actually connect to uh, Vera FM and then in turn to the radio. But this is our session. It's as easy as coming over here to channel selection. Find a channel that's nearby you. Okay, this is my node. It's going to tell me my frequency of 145.010. And... Um, unlike Vera HF and some of the other modes, it'll actually connect to the radio and change the frequency for you. In Vera FM, it will not do that. So if I come over to my 705, I actually have my node saved in here as a memory. So I have the 145.010 in here, and that's gonna vary depending on where your nodes are in your local area. But is what we do is we just come over here once we're all set up and we just hit this start button. And you're gonna hear it talking back and forth with the node. You're gonna see a little activity here showing you the speed and the clarity of the signal. And what the radio is doing is it's sending some data and receiving some data, it's just back and forth. It's just having a digital conversation and you'll see on this side that it's sending a message and it's done it didn't it shows that it sent one message didn't receive any messages and it's as easy as that so some other things that you can do while we wait so when you send it to the test message it will actually turn around and bounce that back to you so you can know that you're receiving too um, some other cool things you can do is there's all kinds of like message traffic templates and stuff in here but you can report a position you can um, actually have it make a map and stuff too so play around with that stuff a little bit too and if you wanted to um, send me a position report I'll send you one back and you can pull it up on the map and stuff too so that'd be kind of a cool cool project for some of you if you guys wanted to uh, practice some of that stuff just let me know and um, send it so I, uh, I check it frequently so let's go back and I'll just recap here so if we wanted to receive that message it should be in there ready to go um, we're not sending any new messages or anything up here but I will just go start again and it's gonna connect 
it's going to do the same thing as it did before but you will notice in here it will actually start to download a message for you too so in the comments let me know if you would like to see more on this um, as far as maybe setting the radio up and all the software and stuff that you have to download just let me know if you guys want to see it I know there's a lot of stuff on there already on YouTube and Google and whatnot but if you guys want to see me do one let me know and I'll, I'll get one done so then when you come back up here you'll see that we have a message that we received and sorry it's not focusing very good but um, I can open well, there you have it. WinLink email is actually fairly simple. Um, it's like I said, if you guys want to see more videos, a uh, more deeper dive in that, let me know and I'll make something to show you how to download the software, how to get the software set up, and uh, maybe some of the little hiccups and stuff that you might encounter. But uh, if, you, if you can get online and just search for it, you'll see it. It's, it's pretty simple. You download two bits of software and you're on your way. Then once you have WinLink set up, you can do uh, like Vera HF, and all those other modes that are in there too so you can do it more long term long distance communication over hf when you have those rigs too um, i might do a hf video here shortly so let me know if you want to see that and i will use my um, yesu ft891 for that on the hf so let me know um, if you haven't subscribed to the channel please do so and like this share it with all your friends let them know where to go find some cool information on youtube bye